So it's Tuesday the 9th of April 2024. Got Gemma here, June there. Where are we today, Gemma? Dudley Zoo. Dudley Zoo. Dudley Zoo and Castle, as you can tell. <laughs> lovely rain. There's a lovely wife. But... You okay, June? Mm -hmm. a nice drive. Took us two and a half hours to get here. Pretty bad weather, but never mind. It's half an hour before it opens. So we're just walking towards the entrance now. Car park all day for £3.50. Bargain. McDonald's across the road. We're hoping that there's a charger across there because we need to. Get 80% charging car to get all the way home. So we'll see you up there. chairlift but as you can see we're working on it so today you can't go that way you have to catch a train there's the train up there so you've got to catch that I'm actually looking forward to going on ski lift whatever it's called but never mind some uh, enrichment for the chimpanzees so now we're going to give them in Get to feed them Gemma and Joan
we've just finished that home ed hour. Now we can we're free to walk around the zoo as much as we want. So we're gonna have a look. Well, we can look around as we're going. So seeing as we're down at the bottom end, let's get looking around what there is. Someone's going to take a picture of them. <laughs> what? Guys, what if we go to Oh, goodness. Just enjoy. <laughs> so, I've got a mate here. He's going to walk around with us and show us how things are going. So, what he says is up in the trees there is his mate, Stan. Stan the man. And he said, there's uh, is it, oh, oh, fuck. Gemma it. just had one land on her head. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he said, carry on walking. There you go. Gemma's having a thick because one's landed on her head. I <laughs> don't understand that one. Yeah. You should be at the zoo. So we all looks like we So Because it's school time, oh, fair and little things are closed. So we're just running now to see feeding time of a wolverine, which is in four minutes, but it's at the other side at zoo, so I don't think we'll make it. So <coughs> the next feeding time is 12 o'clock for tigers, which we, we need to catch that one because it might be the only time they come out. The home education. We have about four or five of them a year. You've got to check on the website, and obviously, it's for home education, but anybody can come to them as long as you've got a kid and you do get into the zoo for half price as well. So, that's the Mount of Tiger 12 o'clock feeding on, on there. So. Let's see. Let's see some 
so eine Menge aus. Flamengo, Flamengo Falls. And all a bit, a bit damp, but these are the Chilean flamingos. Got some nice close-ups. problems that they're facing. Their wild population is actually declining. Unfortunately, lots of places where wolverines are found are where people have built their human settlements and villages now. And unfortunately, people are often shooting the wolverine as the wolverine would try and catch uh, farmers' livestock. Another reason why wolverines are struggling is they're also often hunted for sport and also for that incredibly thick fur of theirs. So for those of you that have just arrived, this is the end of the talk, but I'll just let you know that we've got Flaky, who's the male on the left, and Helga, the one on the right with her blonde highlights. You'll notice that there are some paper bags in their enclosure, and that was some enrichment that we made for them, full of spices. So unfortunately, I don't think our tigers are out today due to the bad weather, and I was meant to be doing a tiger talk at 12. But instead, what I've got is I've got some lovely uh, enrichment, some cardboard boxes that we sprayed with him, which I'm going to be giving to the Arctic foxes, and also seeing if I'll throw some in with the bush dogs as well in just a moment's time. So if you want to hang around until then, by all means, you're welcome to. We do have an extended talk on today, so we've got a octopus walk happening later where we've made them some fishy ice cubes for them to tuck into. The giraffe will be having a feasible at the giraffe tour and we'll be hoping to be doing some sea lion training at the sea lion talk as well. As well as this all round of the day with some meerkat enrichment at the meerkat tour. I hope you're having a nice day. Thanks for playing with the I don't think I've ever seen them before. Arctic foxes. This entire area used to uh, have had the polar bears in the olden days. The first time I've seen a lynx.
Ja. It's easing up a bit now, it's rain. Might even have some sun, so I don't know if I recorded it because my phone's playing up again. Tiger talk was at 12, but because of weather conditions are keeping them in. Just been to see giraffes. We're still at the bottom, we've got to build up the energy to walk up to the top wet. Where the castle is. Uh, see what animals we can see now. I've seen quite a few animals. Arctic fox I haven't seen before. I don't think I've seen a lynx before. So, <coughs> that's two new ones to take off on the zoo. And now it's time for capillar. Capillar, capillar. They'll be inside in this weather. Sharing. Yeah, look at it, that's a big one, isn't it? Hanging. He's just hanging this one, look. It smells of popcorn. It smells of popcorn. He was just hanging. I can't smell it. Can't well, you can't feel the window, but if you were outside. So, what's on that side then? It's a little old for something to go out there. That one, black and white one. So we're having a walk around Lima Wood. We didn't think there'd be any out with it being raining, but we've just seen a couple of black and white ones down here. So we're going to see if we can get them. Gemma's scared that we're going to bite her. She ain't got over the lorikeet landing on her head and screaming and running off. Here's one. They're seals, then what you're thinking about are sea lions. Why is it by itself? They just bite me. So we're just in the cafe now having a break. 20 pound, two cups of coffee, a large Pepsi, a burger and chips. Burger is going to take 15 minutes. We are happy, aren't we? We've seen quite a few animals, I think we're about halfway around. So we'll have a 
of us forward and then we'll continue with journey. So that's where we've just eaten. Oak. Bit expensive, but it's just normal zoo prices. How are your burger gems? Yeah, get my burger and chips. And June just had latte. And big big one up on, on top of the roof. Well that's male one, Jim. So continue to have a look around. Have a look at Castle. It's quite weird how well, a lot of these you can tell that like old style swimming closures. Uh, here we're at the penguins. So we're all having a good time. To animals, because I'm sure one of these holes tied to one there. These two. I think they're just here on the girl's toe. Not interested in that one. There's only that one cafe open today, we've been a school day and it's uh, not full season yet. It's like we do history and ghost talk here. And that's uh, another little cafe, courtyard cafe. You've got some nice little treats at some uh, cat. Loaded beef chili nacho, seven pound. Still big prices, but it looks deader than the last one we went in. So, that one castle. I think we've actually looked around and looked all. Uh, have we seen meerkats? Yeah. Now what meerkats? I don't think we have, they just say yeah to all it. They were lemurs, they were lemurs when we saw that walk around place. 
Are you two just saying yeah? No, yeah. Tell me, because I haven't seen them yet, can I? Well, I'm thinking of lemurs, I'm sure. They're just saying yeah. You know what I mean? See what I have to put up with. That's the train station to get a train down. You saw all the time as it's uh, the train from the place, so. It is cold. Going that triangle now, Gemma.
I bet on a sunny day we're all animals out. It's quite nice too. Might be worth coming over and uh, staying at Travel Lodge. I like all this graffiti that's done there. Uh, somebody's done for them. There's a nice big daddy. Going here, mommy and baby. I wonder if the twins got the nerves similar age, aren't they? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and Gemma are enjoying these orangutans as well. Can't get them to move from this one. <laughs>
started out in that classroom now where it's an exit shop. So how's your day been everybody? It's been cold, it's been wet, afternoon's dried up a bit. But we got it for half price with it being a home education. Got to throw the chimpanzees some enrichment, got to see them. And I don't think they'd have been out but the, one of the keepers got three of them to come out to see us as well. So that one a little bit of extra. They are doing meerkats as well but that's a bit later tonight. Well, this afternoon, three o'clock. So, so it's been a successful day. We're gonna have a look around gift shops. Oh, wow. So we've had a fun day. We've just supported them by spending thirty-two pound in gift shop. Uh, that's about all we can say. Isn't it? It's been nice. Just, just weather. weather. Just weather and been cool. Well, coldness is to do with weather, but on a, on a nice day with this many people here, it'd be amazing. But I'm sure on a sunny day, then it would be complaining that it's packed. And, but I think, what, what are your favourite? Your favourite? Yeah, it's a good day. 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 Yeah, it
Rangatang's favourite. That's what we film most anyway. Didn't get to see Tiger, but I think we got to see most most of other things. So Oh, we're Wolverine more. So, bye bye. Bye. So, all we've come up now is we've parked in right car park. Paid £3.50, we've got a token to get out. So, on to McDonald's now to park up for an hour to charge the car so we can get back to Yorkshire. in Birmingham, we've got a peaky boy in this truck. So I don't know whether this is an overflow car park. Probably a parking. 